Hey everybody, this is Mike over at Triple D. So we are at Epcot today and we're about to walk into the Epcot experience. Uh, it's a new exhibit kind of showcasing where uh, where the uh, park is going over the next few years. So we're going to go inside and check it out and we'll do a little video on it. So we'll see you inside here in just a second. All right, so we're walking into the main area. It's a little exhibit area out there. We'll go in there in a second, but we'll start with it looks like we've got you know a little merch setup some of the new fun logos that uh, debuted when they kind of set this up Carla's looking for some of these t-shirts like this uh, so oh I think that's actually the t-shirt she might be looking for right there I'm not 100% sure but she'll be kind of stoked if that is really what we've got so with that so then you have a fun little food and wine set up right now today is actually the last day of food and wine uh, so they can come get into that. I don't know if that setup goes away or not. So here's one of the first really interesting things. So this is going to be the, uh, the um, new kind of pavilion in Epcot. So if you can tell, there's actually a second level to that building. Let's try and get around here and get a little closer. Yeah, it's a little hard to to see the picture in there, but. It's going to be the new kind of festival center, is um, I think my understanding. Uh, let's see, yeah, this will be the festival center for all the various festivals: food and wine, flower and garden festival, the holidays, uh, all that type of stuff. So that'll open up in the next few years. That's going in uh, where the Fountain of Nations uh, used to be. So let me go over here. Oh, there's a fun little. Uh, Another display and setup that you can see. You can get your picture taken, see the new festival center uh, back in the back, and kind of the newly constructed sort of spine of, of the park. Uh, so I don't know how long that will be here, but probably for a little while. So we walk through the back side of the, the area and get a pretty good view of what their vision is for what the, the park will look like, at least the new kind of. Uh, future world area so you can see the the new main entrance kind of down here and this very large mural it's actually pretty impressive so you see the new entrance uh, with kind of all of the old headstones taken out or, or memorial stones taken out uh, obviously spaceship are still in there then you can kind of see the uh, reinvented center spine of the uh, of the park I forget where it is, but somewhere back in here is the statue of Walt Disney. Um, I think this is the Moana um, Shapes of Water or Water, I forget what it's called, but the Moana Water sort of experience. Uh, nothing really different with the land coming and the Imagination Pavilion and then obviously right there in the very center is the new, uh, new Festival Pavilion. And then if you come over here to the left, you can see the new Guardians of the Galaxy Pavilion, which obviously they're still working on. Saw it a little bit ago, and it's starting to look like the renderings. They're putting on some of the exterior decor and, and sort of design. So it's uh, starting to look like the real deal. So this is a fun little, fun little mural. And then we've got more of these uh, signs. I think Carl's gonna go crazy about these if she hasn't already seen them. But you can see more of these fun little signs up on the walls. And once again, more more decor. This is a Guardians of the Galaxy booth where you can come in and take a picture. It's interesting. And then, oh, is this for the Mary Poppins ride? That's what it might be. Oh yeah, yeah, there's Mary Poppins back in the back. Hi. No, thank you. She might though. Hi, this is the Mary Poppins uh, little setup. Yeah, you go do that. Sorry, Elsa was gonna go have her take a picture taken in the Mary Poppins display. If you don't know, there's a Mary Poppins ride coming to the UK Pavilion in, uh, in a few, I think few years. I forget exactly when it's supposed to open. I'm not sure Disney's actually announced it. So here's some more of the great, uh, the country related and pavilion related uh, signs. And you can see the little sort of thing about the Epcot experience and you can read that so welcome to a place that celebrates the magic of possibility and always has right from the very beginning 
We've been dreaming of some exciting new places for you to explore, discover, and share together. Epcot will always be in a state of becoming. Come inside for a sneak peek at our transformation. So that's the exterior. And then here's the interior showroom. Wow. I may not talk here for a minute because it's kind of loud and I'll let y'all kind of take it in. Over to Epcot's World Showcase, where we bring together cultures and ideas from around the globe. So spectacular and Let's take a peek at one of them. You can see this really cool little, uh, not 3D, but holographic almost design. It's got kind of moving. It's pretty cool. The France Pavilion, where Ratatouille will be opening up, uh, I think, uh, in the next year, maybe the year after, I forget what year exactly. It's uh, Shanghai. Everyone's favorite little shop is here in France. Let's see who's picking up from you. Yes, Let's see more of the uh, nations around um, around World Showcase. It's really great, great little setup here. There's the Moana sort of piece of a new park. The uh, Waters exhibit. No, oh, that's fun. I just saw Remy uh, crawling around, but he went behind the uh, pavilion. So they've got a little display of uh, the Ratatouille ride actually going now. Oh. It's pretty cool. This is basically a 360 degree showing. You can see the wall has uh, images shown on it all around, other than the exits. And even then, there's stuff above it. So I'm going to walk out here and talk a little bit. All right. So. Let me turn the mic around here real quick and then I'll let the camera face me. Alright, so that is the uh, new Epcot experience. Actually, fairly cool little area. Um, the shops and stuff around the edge are kind of okay. They're just little photo ops, but I definitely recommend you go inside and check out the interior show. Lots of stuff to see, and I'm actually going to go back in and watch that a little bit, and i got to find Carla and the girls anyway. So hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give us a like, subscribe, follow us. Uh, we post content like this all the time. We'll talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.